Hello fairy folk, Melissa here, and today I am painting our stunning heroine, Sarah Williams, played by the astonishingly beautiful Jennifer Connolly. I would think the reason why I chose this photo was obvious. This is the As the World Falls Down scene, and Sarah is simply breathtaking in it. Her dress, her makeup, her hair. I'm aware that it's all very 80s, but that doesn't change the fact that she looks perfect. For Sarah's background, I chose very light pastel colours. This wasn't because I feel they represent her best, but I chose it to fit her in this scene. She is almost in a dream and everything is foggy, but generally not unpleasant. So I picked to go for a cloud effect. The colours I used today were cobalt blue, rose, magenta light and mauve pale. I mixed them with lots of white paint to really tone them down and make them more wispy. I also use silver paint for Sarah's jewellery later on in the... At the beginning of the film, I find Sarah's character completely dislikable. Now, in some ways I can empathise. She's a 16-year-old girl living with her dad in this boring suburban town, whilst her mother is off living a glamorous life as an actress, and she so desperately wants to be like her. That, I can understand. But let's face it, to take it out on your one-year-old brother is pretty horrid. She has to have won the award for worst babysitter ever. She won't let him have one toy. When he cries when she takes it away from him, she tells him a terrifying story. And then she gets goblins to take him away forever. I mean, come on. She begins her journey as an arrogant, angsty teenager. But as the film goes on, she matures and becomes kinder. She isn't so quick to judge and in the end sacrifices the life she has always dreamed of to save her little brother. It's a great character arc for her, and it's wonderful to see that growth, change, and love develop throughout the events of the film. Sarah is played by Jennifer Connelly, who was 15 at the time of filming, and she does an absolutely incredible job playing this character. I love Jennifer Connelly and the career she has gone on to have, but this was one of her earliest film roles, and whilst critics did criticise her role at the time, she did a great job. She was a child acting opposite the then 37-year-old David Bowie. I think she nailed it. And as she got older, her performances matured and she gained more depth as an actor. Jennifer Connelly has gone on to star in many successful films and TV series. When she was 30, she starred in Darren Aronofsky's dark and extremely depressing Requiem for a Dream. I mention this role because this film is crazy and the things that happen to our leads during the film are awful but Connelly plays her part perfectly, accurately portraying her character's descent into addiction and prostitution. Other career highlights include A Beautiful Mind, Hulk, Dark Water, Blood Diamond, The Day the Earth Stood Still, Noah, and Spider-Man Homecoming. Now she is currently starring as the anti-villain Melanie Cavill in the new Snowpiercer series on Netflix, which is truly incredible. Sarah is an absolute beauty, and it's a pleasure watching this character grow from a petulant teenager into a mature young woman. From today, my new upload schedule is in effect. My upload days are Monday, Wednesday, Friday, and Sunday, all at 12 p.m. British summer time. But if you're not sure, just hit the notification bell so as not to miss anything. I hope you enjoyed, and thank you so much for watching.